welcome to all of my dear sweet friends and uh, in this video very ceremony and welcome to all of you and this video youtube channel is called we be vinay remach and this is vinay remach before you today i am going to tell you in this video about i got in my whatsapp and uh, in uh, youtube as well that uh, they are telling one of my friend is there but except him most of us don't know and we are getting those questions in our mind that i want to speak english but words don't come to mind what should i do the the, the simple rule to that is before telling those rules i want to tell you that why um, that that is becoming the hindrance that is becoming hurdle one thing is that we are not speaking properly means properly means we are not, until unless we open our mouth we we won't learn okay we won't learn so that's why we should have to open our mouth and speak with our colleagues friends in our family members and with our uh, um, our family members with our friends and with, with our relatives okay or with our teachers as well so until unless you speak with them you won't be perfect perfect which makes men perfect practice makes men perfect but there is a lack of practice lack of practice means we are not using the english language in our day to day life so that's why uh, we are getting back in that so the main rule is is that illiterate people are also ruling the world why because they have the um, confidence boldness courage to speak in front of everyone before everyone so um, even a literate and am employed people are not ready to speak because they bother about the society they bother about their mistakes but until unless you open your mouth you won't learn till your death that is the uh, sentence and that is the truth okay so that is why uh, the main thing is that i want to speak but uh, words don't come to mind at that time what should i do we should do that you should begin with the simple words like uh, um, that is not coming or he is not coming or uh, the link is not opening you should use in that fetching the link is not fetching okay like that fetch means karetaru uh, in kannada karetaru like that or in uh, in english the meaning of that uh, fetch is come okay come or open like that but before the, or instead of that you should use the word only the simple words like uh, the similar word to fetch is come or open okay so if you use like that words like the simple words you should begin with them you should not bother about the mistakes because we are the learners we should not bother about mistakes and uh, until unless we let our fear until unless we let our um, shyness we won't learn so that's why these are the major um, hindrances and hurdles while speaking english so that's why until unless you all sacrifice all those uh, your uh, fear your shyness and uh, uh, your mistakes you won't learn so that's why these are the uh, examples and now how to overcome by the fear fear is nothing but you should begin with the simple words let them uh, let them laugh let the, uh, let them uh, make witty remarks on you let the, let the society keep that aside just to speak go on speaking then only you will learn that is the um, uh, last and last uh, last and best alternate to you is let the society and speak okay until unless you open your mouth you won't learn that is the sentence okay that is the final word that is the final sentence okay so that is that is the final statement as well so you should have to learn english and uh, don't use hard words okay don't use hard, don't use hard words and don't create your own pro own pronunciation okay because you should have to uh, first check in the google you should just google it and uh, google will help you always and ever and forever okay so you should uh, get those uh, uh, the help of the google youtube through you can see lot of uh, videos one thing i have to i want to clear you that we we don't know the uh, grammar of kannada we don't know the grammar of hindi we don't know the grammar of marathi but we are speaking we are able to speak yeah, fluent as well, fluent as well but what is happening how we learn do you remember is that we learned through the imitation so that's why you should use the imitation in english as well you should apply the same so same knowledge and same formulas to the english then you will learn okay this is all about the uh, learning english and uh, i think 
this video will help you to find the edge find the shore find the uh, or seashore or shore or edge to get into the english and uh, put your small efforts and see here practice makes me perfect so you should you should uh, keep that and one thing you should begin with the scratch and uh, move towards the end but you should not begin randomly like that you should not begin okay and uh, um, there is a lack of vocabulary in you so that is why you are not able to speak you are not able to communicate in english so that, that is the major hindrance and barrier for you that is interrupting you interrupting you to speak so you should uh, come over from that gradually not sudden uh, nothing is going to be sudden just you should go glancely and uh, uh, gradually you will learn thoroughly thank you so much for listening thank you very much thank you very much